This is three tips to optimize your Google business profile for your private school to get ranked higher in Google. So the three are complete it, make sure there's a main category that's correct and nap, nap, nap. So the first one, complete it, really, really simple. 90% of people do not complete their Google business profile. So when you go into your business profile and edit the profile, Make sure all of the fields that you see are complete. Make sure you add your services if that's related. And if there's any requests by Google, do it. Add your social profiles or add an exterior photo. So the next one is main category. This is super, super important. So when you go into your um, profile, you can choose from a number of categories so you can't actually make up your own category but when you do a search for private schools near me the all of the ones that rank in that three are independent school and so that is clearly the one you want to choose as your primary category there may be subcategories as well but that's the main category you want to choose so if we then go on to the next and the third and final is nap so what does NAP stand for? It stands for name, address, phone number. So for us at Leafrock Internet Marketing, our name is Leafrock Internet Marketing. That will be the name of your school, the address and your phone number. This is super important for Google to understand that you really are a bona fide private school um, and they will look not just on your website, uh, so you need to make sure it's on the footer of each and every page and it is consistent with your Google business profile nap. But you want to give some thought to making sure it's also all over the Internet, various directories like Yell, for example, or even the Royal Mail. So that's it. There's three tips for optimizing Google for your business, Google business profile.